Hello all, Shoestring here. I'm doing a video on some of the functions of my 5-in-1 power pack from Harbor Freight. I've had several questions on how did some of the functions work, so that's what we're going to talk about today, is some of the functions of the 5-in-1 and how they work. First, we're going to talk about the front just a little bit. You have a pressure gauge here, shows you how much pressure the compressor is using. You have the compressor switch here. On this side, you have your work lights. I'm going to turn them on. Hopefully you can see them. Work lights. And they're actually quite bright in the dark, both sides. So that's very handy to have. Simple switch off and on right here. This gauge here will tell you how much power you have in the battery. Go ahead and push it. And as you can see, we are in the green. And it is good to go. Down here, we have powers for the clamps. The clamps are on each end, a positive and a negative. It's for when you want to jump a vehicle off or just jump off any battery, lawnmower, golf cart, whatever you might need. That's what that's for. And you simply turn it from off to on. The light comes on and the clamps now will start storing up power. If you want to jump a vehicle off, you simply connect these to the positive and negative of the battery. You turn this to on. Leave it on for about five minutes to put enough power in the battery to do it. Then you simply jump it off. Here, we have some cigarette lighter attachments. Where you can use those for that purpose. There's two of them. And that pretty much covers the front. Let's turn it around. Here is we, we have really three important items that we can talk about. We have the fuse that's replaceable, okay? There is a USB back here, by the way, that works fairly well. And two plug-ins. And, of course, this is an inverter. And in a few moments, I'm going to show you how that works. Last thing we're going to discuss on is here is your hose for your compressor. I have done a separate video on how to put air in a tire. I'll put a link at the bottom so you can see how that works. Right now we're going to talk about the inverter though and how easy it is to work. And to demonstrate, I have to blow up this brand new air mattress that Mrs. Shoestring has gotten for us for a trip we have to take. Much cheaper than hotel rooms, by the way. Anyway, so we're going to blow it up, and I'm going to show you how easy this is to work. You take, here's the off and on switch. Turn it on. And as you can see, the light comes on, and you can hear the fan. Right? It is now working. Now, plug in our... Uh, Electrical cord to the air mattress. Then we're going to turn the air mattress switch on. And as you can hear, the pump is working. The air mattress is starting to blow up. Of course, we won't blow up the entire thing on this video. I'm simply showing you how this inverter works. You can plug in lamps. You can plug in fans, and it works extremely well. Let's go ahead and turn this off first. All right, then we'll switch this off and unplug it. And those are the basic functions of five and one. If you have any questions, of course, put them down in the comments. I did this video in the last several because folks have put in the comments they wanted to see these videos. Put down in the comments, and if I have it and capable of doing it, I will do a video on it. If you like this type of video, please subscribe and like it. And shoestring 